Hey guys, um, today we're going to be debunking some cybersecurity myth. What every newbie should know. Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to my channel where we break down everything you need to know about starting a career in cybersecurity, how to become a better version of yourself with personal development and a little insight into my life as an immigrant cybersecurity expert living in the USA. If you are new here, my name is Tolu Lokwe Michael and it's my pleasure to welcome you today. We've got a super interesting topic lined up for the day. We're going to debunk some of the most common cybersecurity myths that are out there about cybersecurity. And this particular one is for our newbies, but that's not to say that you can't learn a thing or two if you're a seasoned pro. So stick around everyone and trust me, I think you will find this video really enlightening. Without further ado, let's see a breakdown of what we have for the day. We're going to go through some major myths about cybersecurity. We'll bust them wide open with fact and data. And then we'll talk about how understanding the truth can actually help you in your cybersecurity career. Myth number one is cybersecurity is only about hacking. You've probably seen movies or TV shows where cybersecurity professionals are always hackers, breaking into systems. But that's just one small, I mean, very small part of the field. In reality, cybersecurity encompasses so much more, like a whole more than average person knows. If you are new to cybersecurity, this is not to get you overwhelmed, not at all. But you should be aware that cybersecurity also involves protecting systems networks and data from attacks because of this we have roles in risk management compliance incident response etc it's a diverse field with a lot of different career paths i've even had someone say for every soft skill you can identify there's a cyber security career path to match that and then some for instance there are a variety of career options one can pick from you can choose to be a security analyst who monitors systems for breaches or a risk manager who assesses potential security risk. There are also roles in penetration testing, but that's just one part of the picture. Same goes for hacking. So thinking that cybersecurity is only about hacking is an inadequate representation of what the field is all about. And data also tell us a bit about this as well. According to the Bureau of Labor Statistics, employment in cybersecurity related roles is expected to grow by 31% from 2019 to 2029. And this highlights the diverse opportunities within the field. Okay? Now, this growth is driven by the increasing need for professionals who can handle various aspects of cybersecurity, not just hacking. Myth number two is only large companies need cybersecurity. I am shocked anyone would think that, but it is what it is. There are actually people who truly believe that small businesses shouldn't worry about cybersecurity. And this couldn't be further from the truth. In fact, small and medium sized businesses are often target because they usually don't have robust security measures in place. The reality here is that cybersecurity is crucial for businesses of all sizes. Smaller companies also, they often handle sensitive data and they can be seen as easy target by attackers. So it's essential for every business to have security measures in place, regardless of their size, either small or big. And I'll say that again for emphasis, your business should have security measures in place, regardless of its size. And this presents an opportunity for you if you're looking to get into cybersecurity. Okay, in case you didn't know, let me be the first to tell you that there are plenty of opportunities in small and medium-sized businesses. These companies often need cybersecurity experts to help them develop and implement security strategies. And guess who could be providing the solution? You. You know, one thing I find amazing is how much data can actually tell us about things like this. For example, did you know that 43% of cyber attacks target small businesses? Did you know that? And not only that, based on a report by National Cyber Security Alliance, 60% of small businesses that suffer a cyber attack, they go out of business within six months. Trust me, 
Now, these are just few of the many stats and reports showing just how critical cybersecurity is for companies of all sizes. Now, let's move on to myth number three. Cybersecurity is only for people with technical background. They say that a lot. The problem with this myth is that it has become something many people have accepted without questioning. Especially for newcomers who now find a career in cybersecurity intimidating. You know, thinking that they need to become coding expert to get into the field. I'm glad to tell you that while technical skills are important, there are many roles in cybersecurity that do not require a deep technical background. For example, roles in compliance, policy development and training, they are crucial and often don't require advanced technical skills. Now think about roles like compliance officer, cybersecurity trainer or even risk manager. These positions focus more on understanding regulations, educating employees and even managing risk rather than hands-on technical work. And to buttress this truth, according to ISC2, a leading cybersecurity certification organization, there's a growing demand for cybersecurity professionals with diverse skills. In fact, soft skills like communication and problem solving are increasingly valued in the field of cybersecurity. Remember what I said earlier, for every soft skill that we can find, there's a matching cybersecurity role for it, even with leftovers. I particularly like busting this next myth. So that brings us to the fourth myth on our list. And that's none other than the myth that cybersecurity tools alone can solve all security problems. Some people think that once they install antivirus software or firewall, they are completely safe. But that's a very dangerous misconception. We know tools are an essential part of the job, but they are just one part of the cybersecurity puzzle. Human expertise, which we often call the human factor, is equally important, if not more. And that's because cybersecurity requires ongoing vigilance, continuous learning, and proactive measures that humans can provide. So it's all about creating a security culture. So if you're just entering the field, understanding how to effectively use and manage these tools is important, but so is developing strategies and educating users. So this is where roles like security consultant or security awareness trainer come into play. You know, a study by Ponemon Institute also found that 52% of data breaches are caused by human error or system glitches and not by lack of security tools. So what is highlight for us is the importance of a comprehensive approach that includes both technology and human factors. Now let's head straight to myth number five. Cybersecurity is boring and repetitive. If you're a cybersecurity professional already, you might actually find this funny, but there are actually people who think cybersecurity is all about staring at lines of code or monitoring endless logs. But let me let you in on a small secret. Cybersecurity can be incredibly exciting and dynamic. And the reason is simple. Every day in cybersecurity is different. You might be responding to an active threat, investigating a security breach, or developing new security protocols. You just never really know what the next minute might bring. And the field is constantly evolving with new challenges and techniques and technologies emerging all the time. So if you're someone who enjoys solving puzzles and staying ahead of the curve, trust me, cybersecurity might be a perfect fit for you. Roles like incident responder, ethical hacker, or cybersecurity researcher can be particularly engaging and fulfilling if you're thinking of giving the field a shot. A survey by ISC2 says that 80% of cybersecurity professionals reported high job satisfaction. 80%! That's a lot. This shows that, contrary to the myth, many find their work interesting and rewarding. And you could just become one of us. Think about it while I tell you about myth number six. Cybersecurity is the responsibility of IT departments. That's what they say. This is a big one. According to this myth, only the IT folks need to worry about cybersecurity. But that's just not true. Cybersecurity is everyone's responsibility. From the CEO to the newest intern, everyone plays a part in keeping information safe. Every single person. The reason is, Human error is a major cause of security breaches. So it's crucial for all employees to be aware and not just aware, follow security practices. And what this means for you as a newcomer is that there are opportunities to work across different departments and educate others about cybersecurity. Roles like security awareness trainer or compliance officer often involve working with 
various teams to ensure that security protocols are followed. In these roles, you get to champion the cause for safe cyber practices. As long as everyone understands their role and can play their part effectively, the overall security posture of the organization is improved. Now that brings us to myth number seven. You need a degree in cyber security to succeed. I've been saying this for years and I'll keep saying it. Believing a myth like this poses a huge barrier for people who are interested in cyber security but don't have a formal background. And that's one of the reasons why we created Excel My Cyber. Because why should you miss out on a life-changing career because of a myth? But again, don't get me wrong, while having a degree can be beneficial, it's only the path to success in cyber security. I have met and even mentored hundreds of professionals who come from diverse backgrounds and enter the field through certifications, boot camps, and self-study. Listen, what's more important is having the right skills and passion for learning. And that's why we have numerous training programs and certifications like the Security Plus, the CEH, the CISSP that are highly respected in the industry. This can often substitute for a traditional degree and demonstrate your expertise to employers. All right. Now, should I shock you even more? According to a survey by ISC2, 49% of cybersecurity professionals entered the field without a degree in cybersecurity. Yeah, you heard me right, 49%. That's like almost half of the professionals in the field. And this shows that there are multiple pathways to a successful career in this industry. The opportunities are practically yours for the taking. With that, we have arrived at our last myth for the day. I wish there was more but that's all right. Now let's tackle myth number eight. This says that cybersecurity is expensive and only for big organizations with big budgets. You see this type of myth, they are the ones that lead to some of the biggest issues businesses face because this is a common misconception that can deter smaller businesses and individuals from investing in necessary security measures. The truth is, sure, some cyber security solutions can be costly, but there are many affordable, even free tools available that provide robust protection. Plus, the cost of a data breach can far outweigh the investment in preventive measures. Believe me, you really don't want to become a victim to find out the cost of a breach. And here is a tip for you if you are just entering the field or you're midway in. Understanding budget-friendly solutions can be a very valuable skill. Like many companies, especially smaller ones, need cybersecurity experts who can implement effective security measures without breaking the bank. And you, my friend, could be the one saving the day and saving them money. A study by IBM found that the average cost of a data breach in 2023 was a whooping $4.45 million. Let me repeat that. The average cost of a data breach in 2023 was 4.4 million dollars on the other hand there are many affordable antivirus programs and security tools that cost a tiny fraction of that amount what that means is investing in cyber security is not only affordable but also necessary so we've debunked the total number of eight cyber security means today while cyber security can be many things we have learned today with sufficient data, it is not any of these eight myths. Whether you're just starting out or looking to pivot into cybersecurity, I hope this video has given you a clearer picture of what the field is really like. Consider diving deeper into one of these career paths and let nothing hold you back. Now, I would love to hear from you. Do you have any questions about getting into cybersecurity? Or maybe you've encountered other myths that You'll be curious about or you want to know drop your questions in the comment section i'll do my best to answer them it's been fun having you join in today remember to give this video a like and hit that notification bell for more eye-opening content like this see you next time bye for now